In Pleasanton, crews had called off that search nearly two weeks ago. KTV's James Torres joining us live this afternoon with more on why law enforcement officials say they're starting this search back up again. James? Alex, typically once a search is called off, that means search and rescue teams exhausted every effort to find what they're looking for. That seemed to be the case for the missing 37-year-old Philip Krejcik. But this morning, we learned the Pleasanton Police Department will search again through this tweet. With the help of the Alameda County Sheriff's Office, they say crews will deploy once again tomorrow morning. Krejcik went missing nearly three weeks ago. According to police, his wife expected him home about an hour after he took off for a run one Saturday afternoon. Philip hasn't been seen or heard from since. There hasn't been any trace of him either. I asked police in the sheriff's office why restart the search now. They tell me they're actually not in any better position to find him than before. There are no new clues or pieces of evidence, but they did tell me the ongoing volunteer search efforts identified an area near the Tahan Canyon that might be worth taking a deeper look at. That's about a mile away from Moeller Ranch, where police say Krejcik started his run. That's also where Philip left his car and phone behind. The search will resume early tomorrow morning. Search and rescue crews will once again meet at Foothill High School. That was the headquarters for a while. About 120 people will be involved using the same resources as before to look at this particular area. Of course, it's a story that we are continuing to follow and we'll update any information once we get it. Alex? All right, yeah, we will, of course, continue.